it was the favorite pastime of every household in Saudi Arabia. Some call it sports entertainment. We used to remember it as wrestling or masara. It was an exciting time to be in. Here are my action figures which I collected back in the 90s. So as you can see, there's the ultimate warrior about to body slam Ted DiBiase, the immortal Hulk Hogan, excellence of execution Bret Hart, Texas Tornado and the Mountie. And then I have another memorabilia. This is a WWE scrapbook that I got from a garage sale here in Jeddah. But in the 90s, wrestling magazines were widely available uh, and were distributed by Al Khazindar company. And uh, we could get magazines that were having superb pictures from our favorite matches, uh, posters, uh, even stickers. You just name it and you would get it. And all we would do was drool over the merchandise that we would see, just like you are seeing, here, seeing it here in this page. As an 80s kid, it's wrestling or uh, as it's called uh, sports entertainment was a very major part of my childhood and like me there are many others in Jeddah in Saudi Arabia because we uh, we only had two TV channels we were lucky enough to get uh, wrestling broadcast on Saudi Channel 1 and Saudi Channel 2 on Saudi Channel 1 it used to be on Tuesday night whereas on Saudi Channel 2 it used to be on Friday and then we had to rent VHS for pay-per-view events which would reach here after two weeks. I remember correctly the first match that I st still have a memory of is uh, from WrestleMania 3, the famous Hulk Hogan and Andre the Giant fight. And from that point onwards, uh, I've, I have seen matches that have been brutal lucky to attend two events here in Jeddah and uh, the only part I regret is not being able to attend the event uh, in Riyadh where Hulk Hogan made the appearance because no matter what happens Hogan is an important part of anyone who grew up in the 80s. Yes, so many great wrestlers uh, whether you're talking about Bret the Hitman Hart, whether you're talking about the late Ultimate Warrior, one of the wrestlers uh, Texas Tornado, Kerry Von Eric and the Von Eric brothers they were I mean these are some of the high uh, household names uh, within the world of professional wrestling and uh, you know, I come from a time that people were watching not only WWF as WWE was known, it was the NWA, it was the AWA and then later on uh, NWA became WCW and then we had the ECW. Lots of wonderful memories, lots of exciting stuff and I, I mean I can go on and on for this one. But anyhow, the whole purpose of today was to showcase my uh, classic 90s uh, WWE action figures uh, which my mom and dad bought me back in the day and I still have them with me and uh, the reason I wanted to do it is because tomorrow I'm gonna be attending Elimination Chamber event uh, uh, with my brothers and I hope it's gonna be really exciting as uh, the previous events previous pay-per-views that we have attended here in Jeddah so I'll be uploading a vlog about that as well Please make sure to like this video, share it, uh, subscribe to my YouTube, follow me on Instagram, follow me on TikTok. Thank you very much for watching.